Welcome to a new video from the parts channel, well, I'm going to make a short video but I find it very interesting, so that you be very careful with this. The other day I made a video about the tensioner pulley stud of a 2000 engine TDI. It was a BKD engine, the BKP also have that stud and some others, I'll leave you the link so. You can see how it was bent, it's not something very common but sometimes it happens, that's why I always say. That that stud, you always have to change it you have to buy the distribution kit that brings it. Here, however, we have a 2000E engine from a Citroen van. And here is the problem, look at you, there we are extracting the tensioner pulley, and you see that it is turning irregularly, this means that there is a screw there, which is also bent. But of course, here the problem is that the screw that has been bent is a separator screw. That screw, theoretically, is never changed, and it does not come with the kit distribution. Here, as I say, there you can see CLRly the bent screw, ok, this bent screw cannot be put back, this is fixed to the block, it is screwed to the block, and the screw that you see on the left, is screwed to this spacer screw, ok? Here, as I said, the person who did the distribution made a mistake, and it is that, you see? Here we are putting the other screw correctly, this one that is in good condition and that took us a long time to get it, by the way. Take a look. There it is we have installed, the problem is that when removing the other screw from the pulley, this screw can separate from the block and it is enough to separate a couple of millimeters, for this to happen, the separator screw bends, for this reason, always when on these engines when you do the timing, you check that the bolt is snug against the block. As I say, sometimes when you remove the other bolt, the other bolt, this spacer bolt can come out a bit, it unscrews a bit and best with that bit, so that as dig or. There is a couple of millimeters here of separation and this screw bends and the distribution of the car engine can break, with this spacer screw you always have to be careful. What we usually do, when we do the distributions, is to remove also this screw. We clean it well, we put an adhesive back on it, be it neural or another adhesive. And we adjust it well and so there is no more that problem, ok? Because, as I said, these screws do not they never change because they don't come with any timing kit. This bolt is supposed to last as long as the engine block, well, here I leave you. This short video, if it has been useful to you, then do not forget to give a like and subscribe to the channel.